It's rolling, what's up? <laughs> Something unexpected about me. Well, one time I went into Gwen and I had my Ziploc bag and I got caught stealing a sandwich. Okay, let's not use that one. Okay. <laughs> I'm Jennifer Long and I'm a first generation college graduate. I chose Seattle Pacific because of the academics and the food, of course, um, and because it was in Seattle. I was a transfer student from another university, and to help out with finances, I got a work-study job as an admissions intern. Besides my financial aid, I was able to learn how to budget uh, through the help of the Center for Career and Calling, figuring out what I should spend my money on, whether that's going out with friends or go, uh, spending money on food or just the miscellaneous things. I experienced a lot of hardships my first year of college, and so I found community in my dorm room. Um, lots of people from different backgrounds, late night talks, getting to know each other, studying together, thinking back freshman year and not knowing where we were going, what to major in, what life was going to be like, and now we're, we're all kind of grown up. Um, we all have jobs, doing things that we love. It's just really exciting, and even coming from a Christian background and a faith uh, environment here at Seattle Pacific and knowing how they're impacting their communities, it's, it's exciting to see. My mom and my dad were both refugees from Cambodia and they decided to escape their hometown um, and the war at the time to come to the United States to provide my brothers and I a better life. They kept telling me, Jennifer, we don't want you to work as hard as we do. We want you to go to college, get an education. And I remember my graduation, I invited everyone I knew. <laughs> I think I had about 50 tickets. I remember meeting them for pictures afterwards and everyone's crying, I'm crying. And it was just a moment that they've been dreaming for, for so long for me. And so for me to give that back to them, to accomplish their dream to come to the United States was something I'll, I'll always cherish.